Hi, I'm Chad from Chaotix. Today we're going to cover customer value flywheels. By the end of this short video, I want to introduce a new way to look at customer value and show you how to execute a customer value flywheel for your business. Customer value has traditionally been measured in revenue. You take the average size of purchase, the frequency of purchases, and then you measure that over the course of years that a person frequents a business. To put it simply, if we're looking at a hardware store in my neighborhood, maybe I spend $75 for the course of 10 years while I live in that neighborhood. My value to that hardware store is about $9,000. Now this is a really simple way to measure customer value. And it misses three key aspects that I wanna to cover today. The first is market research and insights. If I'm a business, I'm probably spending money on market research every single year. Now that might be with a research firm or it could be on expensive focus groups. Really, one of the best ways to gather customer insights is from actual customers. If I'm providing feedback and insights to this hardware store that allow them to make better business decisions, that's real value for them. It allows them to improve their business and drive more revenue down the road. It also allows them to reduce market research costs because they're talking to existing customers. They don't have to go out and find existing panels. Number two is user-generated content or UGC. Some research shows that UGC is 42% more effective at driving purchase than brand-created content. Additionally, 90% of US consumers rate UGC as one of the most powerful drivers for them when they're making a final purchase. Now, a lighting fixture, for example, might look great when it's shot in studio, but if I'm buying something online, I wanna see what it looks like in an average person's kitchen. When your consumers are creating content for you that is driving purchases, and it's also reducing marketing cost. Finally, customer success is the third piece that's missed when we're measuring customer value. When customers can support, train, and inspire one another, that means that your staff doesn't have to do it. And it also means that those individuals are seeing ideas, they're being inspired by things that other real people are creating, not just what your marketing team is putting together. Now this drives long-term brand loyalty, and again, it reduces costs. This new formula for calculating customer lifetime value is absolutely more complicated, but it does a much better job of capturing all the ways that your customers can add value for your brand. Companies who begin to look at customer value in a more holistic way can optimize for research, UGC, and customer success. What this allows them to do is build a proverbial flywheel, a system that spins faster as you add more energy. So customers who are already frequenting your business can contribute to research and insights. This allows you to make better business decisions and drive more customers. As this larger pool is creating user-generated content, you're improving your conversion rate and you're reducing your costs. This even larger pool of customers can start to support each other, answer each other's questions, inspire one another. You can see how the system continues to grow and build energy. Online communities are one of the best tools for a brand to use in order to build this customer value flywheel. It allows your brand to connect directly with your customers and bring them together in an online space. Think of it a little bit like a private Facebook for your brand, where you can gather insights, generate user-generated content, and you can connect customers with one another so that they can support, train, and inspire each other. I hope this video has offered a new perspective on customer value, and I hope I've made a decent case for applying this new formula to your business. I hope that you build a customer value flywheel, and I hope you use a community to do it. Subscribe to our channel for more content about community, or visit chaortix.com for more information. Thanks.